Uh, over the past few weeks, I've spoken uh, with uh, executives at both Pfizer and Moderna who have assured me uh, that we are very much continuing to be on track uh, for receiving our full doses of vaccines in the timelines provided. When the Trudeau government told us a month ago that it had secured 400 million doses of COVID-19 vaccines, it said that meant every Canadian who wanted one would get it in a timely way. After all, at 400 million, we had more doses secured per capita than any other country in the world. To, to vaccinate every Canadian in Canada twice, all we need is about 76, 78 million doses. A month later, though, reality is setting in. And what it shows is that we were oversold a bill of goods. First off, securing vaccines doesn't mean you've actually bought them. It doesn't mean they're in Canada and it doesn't guarantee a delivery date. What it is, it's an option to buy them when they become available. Now, in five of the seven companies that produce these vaccines, and that involves over 70% of the ones that we have these options on, their vaccines haven't yet been approved for use in Canada, so they're not immediately available to us in any event. Now, to be fair, of the two contracts where we have these options, which are Moderna and Pfizer, there would be enough vaccines still to do every person in Canada twice, which is the recommended dosage. But the problem there, as we've seen, is that because of production issues with Pfizer's plant in Europe, we're not getting any doses from anybody this week, and it's going to be slowed down in the coming weeks to the point where we're now, there are 19 other countries ahead of us in terms of the number of people they have vaccinated or percentage, including comparable countries like the United Kingdom and the United States. Okay, so what's going to happen going forward? Well, we're not sure when we are going to get these vaccines. And that's important because you remember these vaccines have to be administered twice within certain time frames. Uh, not surprisingly, a poll by Angus Reid Institute that was released uh, recently says that Canadians are growing increasingly concerned about this. Right now, more Canadians see the government has done a poor job of securing vaccines than a good job. And that's completely reversed from a month ago. The bottom line in all this is the longer it takes for us to get these vaccines, the more people will get sick, the more people will die, and the longer it will take our economy and our lives to get back to normal. So it's very understandable that Canadians are very concerned. I'm Laurie Goldstein of the Toronto Sun. We're always interested in your views, and please follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and our YouTube channel.